Hi everyone, Courtney here, quarantine style. So forgive my appearance, please. I just got through working out and my hair is a hot mess. I wanted to do a little dinnerly update and I'm sorry about the sun. I know that good video, um, you're conscious not to have light behind you, but it's impossible in this house. So my daughter uses this dinnerly service, this dinnerly service and she sent me a coupon and I got this box for like nine or ten dollars plus shipping. I think it was like maybe 15 bucks. It wasn't much. And I thought I would open it and give you a review as I open it so you can see what they've got here. Now, I keep things simple, y'all. So these tomatoes look like a really good brand of tomatoes. I'm pretty impressed with that. And this produce looks very fresh this is 12 mils um this broccoli is cut in half but it looks fresh four mils per uh goya beans which are good quality these are a little bit more expensive at the store some italian seasoning there's a lot in here all right let's see i'm not going to repeat um there's a lot of green peppers i'm not a big fan of green peppers the big thing I would say, don't do this, that these carrots look, everything looks really, really fresh. Um, this is one of the problems. White rice, I don't eat white rice, but I will make it or I'll give it to my kids. But yeah, I don't eat white rice. I have brown rice. Garlic, I'll be honest, I usually buy the pre-pressed. That might be a little bit more work for me. More bell peppers, holy mother. Scallions. Okay, let's see what else we have in here. Zook. Have you noticed, like in Britain, they call it a courgette? I think that's so cool. There is this huge cold thing. I wonder if this is recyclable, because if it is, this would come in really handy. Gosh, that may be worth the, the money. Uh, corn. Four cheese ravioli. See, these are really cheap. I fed my kids on these. I'm not saying this brand is cheap, but my children were raised on these because we were what I would call part-time vegetarians when they were growing up. I was full-time before they were born. There we go. Oh, this is, this is cute, but it's kind of wasteful, right? Feta. But I guess if you're not gonna use it, it's better. Salsa, mozzarella. I did get the vegetarian box. It was very limited. Salsa, um, mozzarella. Here we go. So I'm gluten free and I really don't like to eat a lot of dairy and it was very limited for vegetarians. And there's just more cheese. Really cute little Parmesan. Um, the quality looks to be really, really nice. And you can go down, there's another one of those frozen things. So here's all the food. Lots, uh, I mean, for $55 is what this would normally cost. This is three dinners, four servings. That's not cheap, but it's not bad if you consider, and here's the way I was looking at it. I did this because of quarantine, and um, I thought this will buy me a few days between grocery shopping trips. And if you are saving trips to the store, you're gonna automatically save money. So you could do that a couple ways. You could do one of these dinner boxes, or you could, um, you know, simply just menu plan and stick to it. I feel like looking at this, because I, you know, I'm almost 50, I've been shopping for a long time. I could probably buy all of this for about half that, but you wouldn't expect them to not make a profit, right? Um, next two weeks, I went in and changed my order because like I said, I'm vegetarian, so uh, I don't, and I'm gluten-free, and I realize I have a pretty bougie diet, and it's really picky, but that's because I have some health problems, and the way I mitigate those risks is by eating super healthy. So I did go in and change a couple of the orders to shrimp because they had no fish for my husband and my son. I will probably just make it, um, make myself some other kind of protein on the side, so anyway, there we are. I think I'm gonna give it a month to see how it goes. 
I have sent them an email to see if there's any gluten-free options or more vegetarian options. If you know of a service that has more options for people like me who have a little bit of a stricter diet, please share with that. I'll let you know how the meals turn out. Thank you. Bye.